unconditional love. When I was around the age of 30, my father tossed me aside and told me something that would change my life. The truth of us were alone in his beating up old girls. In a side street of one of the poorest suburbs of London, he turned to me and said this. Songs, whatever you do in your life, know this. The door of my heart will always be open to you. I was only a young teenage at the time. I didn't really understand what he meant. But I knew it was something important. So I remember it. My father would be dead three years later, when I became a monk in North Thailand. I thought all the those words of my dad. Our home at that time was a small council flat in a poor part of London. Not much of a house to open a door into. But then I realized that was not what my dad really meant. What were lying within my father was like a terrible rapper in the cloth with the most articulate expression of loss that I know. So, whatever you do in your life, know this, the doors of my heart will always be open to you. My fathers were offering unconditional love, no strings attached. I was his son and that was enough. It was beautiful. It was real. He meant it. He just courage and wisdom to say those words to another. To open the door of your heart to somebody else with no if. Perhaps we might think they would take advantage of us. But that's not how it works. Just in my appearance. When you are given that shock of love from another, it's like receiving the most precious of gifts. You deserve it. Keep it close to your heart, lest it be lost. Even though, at the time, I only partially understood my dad's meanings. Even so, I wouldn't dare hurt just a man. If you guess the words to someone close to you, if you really mean them, if they come from your heart, then that person will reach upwards. Not the work to miss your love. Merit. Since I became a silent bird monk, I have married many women. But of my child, as a Buddhist monk, is to perform the religious part of Buddhist marriage ceremonies. According to my tradition of Buddhism, a lay Buddhist is an official marriage celebrant. Thus, many of the couple regard me as the one who married them. So I have married many women and many men as well. It is said that there are three rings to a marriage, the engagement ring, the wedding ring, and 
the suffering. So trouble is to be expected. When there is trouble, the people who I have married often come to talk. He in a monk who like and see his life. I include in my marriage service the man three story intended to keep the three of us out of trouble for as long as possible. Commitment. My view of relationship and marriage is this. When the couple go out, they are mostly involved. When they become angry, 